of the plate type of pitcher. Three El goes. Correa rips it into center field. The Astros will take the lead. Zimmer over to cut it off, and Guriel running on the pitch goes first to third. It's an RBI single for Correa, and it's 1 0 Houston. Where do you hold the ball? How do you release the ball? How does your arm climb? Oh, get up! Correa deep to left, and he's That's nice. a 2 0 lead for the Astros on his 16th of the year. How did you like that one, Lance? What did uh, you see? I love it. I love it. It's all uh, Carlos has been. Uh, I think one of the main things for me this year is just the way he's been grinding out at bats, whether it's 0-2, uh, 3-0, he's making sure he's getting his pitch, he's not ex expanding in the zone, uh, out of the zone, I should say, and his swing is just locked in, man. It, it, it's beautiful to see. That's one of my favorite postseason memories. Who does that? Lance McCullers Jr. does. Oh, get up! Abraham Toro! That's two! Third of the year in just his 20th game, Toro makes it. Three to nothing, Astros. Man, I'm not to get on the mic more often. <laughs> we got our boys hitting bombs. The new Astros hitting coach, Lance McCullough. <laughs> yeah, with this lineup, I mean, yeah, a, a lot of credit to Snitz and Trone, but man, with this lineup, uh, you know, they got, they got, they got a good gig. They got a good gig. Speed <laughs> here. Payoff pitch. Bouncing ball right side, backing up Garcia to second. The relay, not in time. The speed of Zimmer gets him safe at first. It brings Rosario home for the first Indians run. RBI fielder's choice for Zimmer, his eighth run driven in this year in 30-plus games. Yeah, that's a good at bat. 0-2. Line drive towards left, but Jones is there. He can't make the play. Rosario will score to cut the lead to one. Ramirez in the second. It's three to two. Still nobody out in the Cleveland seventh.